Well, here he is, the top scorer in the league, the main feature of our match today, and it's live. We're here to describe the action for you. Nice to have you with us, Martin Tyler here and Alan Smith. Today it's Celta, Vigo, and they face Espanyol. He's the one we're focusing on, I think with good reason. Two in his previous match, a clear danger man for the opposition. Delta will play like this today. This is their 11 players. One main striker, one probably just off it. How are they going to find attacking routes with this formation? Well, whether they can create through the middle, we'll wait and see. I just think today those two wide lads in midfield are going to be important. Both got a bit of pace, capable of getting around the outside. Here's the team list for Espanyol. 4-4-2, but a diamond shape is how he's gone, particularly during matches. It may be that he's going to start with a diamond today. Yeah, but I've seen this manager so often switch formations midstream during the course of a match, and we might see that again today. Well, this could be a terrific contest, and it's underway now. Saw the pass coming and got there first. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. Granero. Shots on! Still a chance in there off the goalkeeper. Opportunity to cross it now. And here's the shot. Keeper might be needed again. He didn't hang on to the ball. Velotti. Just a mistake, really. He's not even asked too much of the opponent. It's just a mishit pass. A chance to break away now on the counter. That's a missed opportunity on the counter-attack. Coup. Cool. Working hard just to see to take the lead. And it's a shot now! Well, that's great work by the goalkeeper. Clever ball. Time here to strike at goal. Can he finish? And shoots! Victor Sanchez. It's a pass, another pass. At the moment, just giving them possession and not much more than that. Gets his cross in. Cleared away, well away from goal. And now the shot! And that will be a corner. Yeah, the crowd sensing momentum is with their team here. Corner played in. Quick reaction time here. Well, that's the opener. And it's been coming. The better side, but you have to score when you're on top. We wondered whether they would do that, but they have done, and they've done it in fine style. And a goal for Espanyol. Well, talk about luck. The keeper makes a good save, but straight into the path of the attacker. 
different angle on it here. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Correa. Well, there's a chance playing at home to extend this run of two consecutive victories into three. Yeah, and the way they've played in those previous two, I, I can see them making it three as well. Got to be. Goalkeeper hangs on. Routine for the keeper. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Shots on here. It comes out off the goalkeeper. Referee's pointed for a goal kick. Well, that was the goal that gave the team the lead. Let's have another look at it. Correa. Baselli. They can be quick on the break now. I think the wide man's got a chance here. There's space out near the touchline. I must say the defender <laughs> took a chance and got away with it. Left the defenders trailing now. Here's a chance. Baselli. Victor Sanchez. Daniele Vasselli. Now, here's a chance to get at the opposition. Oh, his teammates will thank him for that. Velotti. Granero. Could whip it in from here. Corner to come because of the tackle that sent the ball behind and here comes the corner can finish it off and the keeper able to stop that one and they're looking good when they get the ball out wide as they've done here couldn't keep it this turnover could be costly against the side that can break like this Still progressing on the break. He has to clear it. Coup. Baselli. An opponent around him, that's good screening of the football. Granero. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. Deandre Yedlin, Daniele Baselli. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. He's cut it back looking for a teammate. Just seemed to be a bit too tense at the final moment, and it could have been an important moment for them. Well, I just thought it was careless, actually. Baselli. Well, the referee has signaled for half-time, and it's 1-0 here. I think that's a good performance, isn't it, Alan, from him in the first half?
Well, he played really well, didn't he? And he got himself a goal to put his team ahead. He'll be pleased with that first 45 minutes. And the referee has blown to signal the start of the second half. Trying a bit too hard, trying to force the pass, and it went uh, straight to an opponent. Baselli, I would guess in this possession play here, they're trying to get the opposition to come out and marry them and maybe then pass their way through them. Granero. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. This could be the leveller. You can see the deflection there. Corner. Corner's taken. Cleared away, well away from goal. And he gets ahead to it, but can only knock it out of play. Correa. Shots on here. That is a fine goal, and it's brought them back level once more. Very good play. Certainly, they've been very positive since they went behind, and now they've got reward for that with an equalising goal. Well, there's a goal that's perhaps not gone according to the script here. They just picked their moment to get forward after a lot of defending. Yeah, and they can thank the defenders for that, but uh, when they did get the ball, they moved it forward really quickly. They were, they were ruthless there. great news for the manager because I think he made uh, a couple of changes there and now they're back on level terms it is uh, level both sides have scored here now it should be a very good game you'll see it on EA Sports of course and it is for the away team the visiting team and it's their next action in La Liga He's got the ball away from him with the tackle. Velotti loses possession. DeAndre Yedlin couldn't hold on to the ball. Coup. The space to go forward into with the ball and that will end the threat at least for the moment Correa here's a chance to whip it in this is an exercise in patience as they try to get an opening that's his game isn't it intercepting Victor Sanchez That's good movement forward here. And they get it away. Velotti. It's time for the substitutes, I think, and the substitution for the home team here. Came in with the challenge, and the ball broke free. Correa. Velotti. And here's the shot. Getting the ball back and thinking it guided through. In with a chance. Can really get at the opposition here. Trying to get behind the defenders to get in a good cross. Good work by the goalkeeper. Good reading of the play by the defender. Daniele Baselli. It's a pass, another pass. At the moment, just giving them possession and not much more than that. Now, this is an interesting attack. Well, the cross doesn't get past the first man. 
Granero. Chance to cross it. It's unlike him, really, to play the ball straight to the opposition. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Granero. Shots up. Has to score. Into the lead they go. It's a fine, well-worked goal from a team that's looking well-oiled and looking very well-drilled. They've been the better side, they've played with great panache up to this point, and that goal really sums up the way they have been playing. Excellent. What a wonderful volley. It's a wonderful ability to have, isn't it, to connect so sweetly. It's all about timing that volley. going to be two changes now and we restart the game 2-1 manager thinking for the away side time for a change very much in free kick territory this foul no, I've seen him bury these from this distance and the goalkeeper not really tested by that free kick Alvaro. It's Yedley. Here's a chance. Splendid goal here. It's getting better and better for them. It's a great spell for this team. Two goals in rapid succession. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now, the scorer. Counting down towards the end of the 90 minutes. Nine minutes left. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. Maybe just missed, kicked it a little bit there and pass goes straight to the opposition. Granero. Victor Sanchez. Oh, it's lovely passing this. And knocking the ball around with such confidence. Yeah, it's the understanding between those players down there. They seem to be reading what each is going to do before they've done it. Well, that's what substitutes are for, to be used. And we've got one coming on now. And that will end the threat, at least for the moment. Trying to catch the other team out with a quick break here. Could pull one back here. Three minutes from the referee via the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. Going forward well. Oh, time to get the cross now. Neatly intercepted. Cleared his lines. Alvaro. Certainly wanting to... And the referee brings it to a halt. There we are, Alan. We can pick over the bones as much as we like, but the fact is, it's a defeat. Yeah, and a defeat is a defeat, and they always hurt, and uh, there's always something for the manager to look at and try and improve upon, and there was plenty there. Some final thoughts on one of the better performers today, Alan. Got himself a goal and uh, put in a really good shift. Excellent performance.